Welcome back. The Center for Music Therapy and Wellness helps a wide variety of mental and or physical disabilities through music. They're also working um, with Parkinson patients to help them to feel better. So take a look at this. There's one thing Kelly and I have learned over the years is the benefits of music therapy. And here at the Center for Music Therapy and Wellness, there's a group here in the Ozarks that really takes advantage of those benefits. And that's the Parkinson's group of the Ozarks. Cassie, it is so great to see you. Yes, thank you so much. Can you tell us about the Parkinson's group of the Ozarks? Yes, we are a nonprofit organization based out of Springfield, Missouri that started in the late 1990s. We provide programs and services for Parkinson's families here in Southwest Missouri. Some of those programs will entail um, support group guidance, our wellness classes, one-on-one -on -one assistance, we do learning events, community outreach, and just a ton more. Cassie, you've been doing this program for about three years, and I, I yes. asked you earlier, I think you've seen some really incredible benefits. So yes. this is kind of a mind-body connection. Yes. How does it work, and what have you seen? Well, just a little bit of a, a backstory here. Uh, Parkinson's disease is a neurodegenerative disease. Mm -hmm. And what that can entail is um, affect, uh, affecting motor symptoms. Um, a lot of people associate it with the shaking, the tremors. Mm -hmm. um, it can also affect a lot of non-motor symptoms. Um, some of that may be things like facial masking, where there's like a poker face where you can't kind of read a person's expression. Um, a soft voice where it's very hard to hear. Sometimes extra saliva is produced and it causes slurred speech. So a lot of these non-motor symptoms people are not aware of. Um, and a lot of our Parkinson's families have been looking for resources that can help with those symptoms. And that kind of where this class started about. Um, we have our music therapy class and it does a lot of activities that will help with those symptoms um, to improve uh, the issues that uh, the Parkinson's families face. And you know, music, Jeremy, you know, music is the language of everybody. Yes. And I think when it was created, it just sounds change us and, and heal us in a lot of different ways. Yes, um, a lot of times with the music therapy, and uh, Taylor will explain a little bit more about that as well too, sometimes um, they use a little bit of rhythmic cueing. Mm -hmm. So sometimes that beat, that tempo, um, kind of helps get the muscles moving on to a certain pace and uh, gets that brain coordination going as well. So there's definitely a connection with that. Is it all the coordination? Is that something to look for with Parkinson's patients? Are you seeing that the patient comes in, but also the caregivers? I know there'll be people in the class as well and helping they can maybe use these skills at home, maybe not just when class yeah, time yeah, right. is. Yes, a lot of our care partners will contact us and they're wanting to know what they can do for their loved one to help them with uh, the symptoms of the disease. And learning some of the class activities is very beneficial and things that they can take home and it's something that they can both enjoy because we encourage the care partners to come as well. Oh, so that's, that's great. Important. They can take this home and work on it too. Yes. And your classes have grown so I know that yes. this is really helping a lot of people. Um, yes. When are your classes? Our classes, we actually have two of them. We have a class that's more associated with drumming and that's on Thursdays at 10:30 uh, a.m. Mm -hmm. and then we have a class here on Fridays at 11:30 a.m. But we have grown so much that uh, we are very happy and excited to announce that we will be starting another music therapy class that will be at 9.30 a.m. on Fridays here as well. So if somebody's watching and maybe they have a family member yeah. suffering from Parkinson's and they don't know what to do, how can they reach out to you, sign up for a class, and get more information on just the resources available right. to help them? They can contact our organization. Our website is www.parkinsonsgroup.org or they can call the phone number listed as well. Oh, that's so, so nice. And the other thing is they're making friends with people who are having some of the same issues, so that's a wonderful thing that happens as yes. well. Yes, yes. It, it feels like a good support group. No, it's a you great know? support group. It's music group. therapy, it's also support, yeah. and really putting a lot of goodness back into Absolutely. our community. Thank yes. you so much, Thank Cassie. Yes. So if somebody wants more information, once again, what's the website? One more time. www.parkinsonsgroup.org. Thank you. Thank right. you so much. Thank you. Yeah. That's such a cool program. It is. And by the way, stay tuned next week mm -hmm. because we have more segments that we shot there with some of the patients and yeah. about their classes. And I got to watch one of their classes and it was really fun. Yeah, we were both there doing some of their classes with them and actually doing some drumming, mm -hmm. which was really, really cool. Really cool. So that's mm -hmm. a great organization and we both love music and it really does. Music is that common factor that brings people together and it's and I was loving hearing their stories the mind, about. The yeah. mind-body uh, connection there and that helps them so much. It's so good. That's great. Okay.